Hello everyone and welcome to another insightful session right here on this channel with me, Tetete. Today we will be looking at the Jan Medza Scholarship in Artificial Intelligence and Adaptive Systems 2024 at the University of Sussex in the United Kingdom. If this is the first time you are watching any video on this channel, I am glad that you are here and I know you are definitely going to find a scholarship that is worth applying for. Kindly hit on the subscription button for me and then the post notifications so that as and when I release a new video, you would be notified. If you are a returning viewer, I am glad that you are sticking and staying here with me. Now let's jump straight into the video for today. Like I said in the introduction, we would be looking at the Jan Metzger Scholarship in Artificial Intelligence and Adaptive Systems at the University of Sussex in the United Kingdom. This is the homepage of the scholarship. I would be inserting all the relevant links in the description so that you can verify the information for yourself before you put in your application. The Jean Metzger Scholarship in Artificial Intelligence and Adaptive Systems is kindly funded through a generous donation from Success Aluminous Jean Metzger. This scholarship is available for a student taking up a place on Artificial Intelligence and Adaptive Systems MSc, including with industrial placement here at Success in 2024. What you will get. Okay, so this is the value of the scholarship. You get eleven thousand nine hundred and fifty pound fee waiver. So this is a fee waiver of eleven thousand nine hundred and fifty pounds. Okay, so the type of award is a tuition fee reduction. The funding type is donor funded. And then now let's look at the eligibility. Scholarship applicants need to have accepted a full-time place on the Artificial and Adaptive Systems MSc or Artificial Intelligence and Adaptive Systems with an Industrial Placement Year MSc. So you need to have accepted a full-time place on any of these two courses, okay? So let's look at how you can apply for these two courses and then we continue with the eligibility criteria and then we look at the scholarship application portal, okay? So what you would do is that once you are here, you can just click on the program. However, I do not want to close this page, so I'm just going to right click and then open the program in a new tab. Okay, so this is Artificial Intelligence and Adaptive Systems, MSc. And then I'm opening the second link, Artificial Intelligence and Adaptive Systems with an industrial placement here, MSc. So I open the second link as well, okay? So now let's look at how we can apply for these two masters. And then we finish looking at the eligibility criteria. So this is the first master's course, Artificial Intelligence and Adaptive Systems. You need to gain an offer to study this course before you can apply for the scholarship. So we are looking at how you can apply for the scholarship. So this is the homepage of the master's course. Once you are here, you are going to see some subheadings here, key information, entry requirements, models, our experts, fees and scholarships, careers, and then apply now. Okay, so now let's look at the key information. It is a one year full-time program or two years part-time program, but to be eligible for the course, you need to study a one year full-time program. The start date is September, 2024, and you have to apply by 1st August, 2024, if you are an international student. Okay, let's look at the entry requirements. So this is the UK entry requirements, but then we are international students, so we click on international requirements. Once you click on international requirements, all you have to do is to select your country. So you click on select your country and then you type in your country. I am from Ghana. So I type in GH and then Ghana pops up. So these are the requirements if I am coming from Ghana. So depending on your country, the University of Success is going to give you the requirements. So from Ghana, you need a bachelor's degree from a public university with a minimum second class lower division. Thus, you need a minimum of second class lower division. Okay. Then the subjects specific requirements. Your qualification should be in a scientific or technical subject or other discipline, including computing and cognitive subjects demonstrating either numeracy or computer literacy. 
You may also be considered for the course if you have other professional qualifications or experience of equivalent standing. Okay, please note our entry requirements, our guidelines, and we assess all applications on a case by case basis. Okay, so coming from Ghana, you do not need any English language test requirements. So once you see the IELTS academic here, do not fret. All you have to do is to scroll down, and there is this subheading here alternative English language qualifications. Once you are here, you just click on select from list. Once you click on select from list, the whole list of um, certificates here that exempt you from the English language test okay so once you are from ghana you have the ghana senior secondary school certificate that is your ssc it exempts you from any english language requirements there's also the west african senior school certificate that is the wasi this is for um Nigerians as well. So this exempts you from the English language test. If you are from Kenya, there's the Kenya Certificate of Secondary Education. Okay. So it's going to depend on your country. But coming from Ghana, Nigeria, and Kenya, I can definitely tell you that you are exempted from any English language test. Okay. So these are the entry requirements. You can always check out the fees and scholarships once you have the time. But then our concentration is on the Jan Metzger scholarship and how you can apply for that scholarship. So our concentration here is on how you can just apply for the course and then gain admission because we are concentrating on the Jan Metzger scholarship. Okay. So we move from here. Once you are ready, you just click on apply now. Okay. So once you click on apply now, it is going to bring you to how to apply for a master's course at the University of Sussex. You just have to scroll down and then you click on apply or check an existing application okay so once you click on this it's going to bring you to the postgraduate application system and then here it is going to ask you to create an account so you just click on create an account and just like that you can sign up and then start applying for your masters in artificial intelligence and adaptive systems that is how you can apply for the course okay so now let's look at the next course that is the artificial intelligence and adaptive systems with an industrial placement year so you go through the same process you can check the key information and then the entry requirements always make sure to move to international requirements then select your country and then once you select your country you can also check the alternative english language qualifications and once you are done with that you can always click on apply now and then follow the same procedure to apply for this master's course as well okay so now we move back to the scholarship page because now we have looked at how you can apply for any of these two courses once you receive a full-time place on any of these two courses then you have met the first eligibility then the second eligibility states that uk and overseas applicants will be considered okay so once you are an overseas applicant that is an international applicant you would also be considered for the scholarship and then the third criteria is that the successful applicant will demonstrate experience of an engagement with open source okay so the number of scholarships available there's only one scholarship available that means this scholarship is going to be a very competitive one but then you can always put in your application because you do not have to pay any application fee you do not have to write any ielts so you can put in your application and then just hope and pray for the best so like i said on the um, program page the application deadline for the program is first august for international students but we are not going to go by that application deadline because we want to be considered or we want to apply for the jan meds gas scholarship okay and the deadline for the scholarship is on the 1st of july 2024 at 11 59 pm ghana time okay so it is important for you to apply as soon as possible if you are interested in this scholarship then apply immediately after you finish watching this video put in your application because the application portal for the scholarship is going to open in april and then the deadline is going to be on the 1st of July 2024 so once you put in your application you would have ample time to receive your offer and once you have your offer you can 
apply for this scholarship okay so how to apply applications open in april 2024 okay so i'm going to put um the scholarship link also in the description because once you click on uh, applications open in april 2024 it's going to bring you to the scholarship platform however since the application hasn't opened the scholarship form is not yet here i'm going to put the link in the description and i'm going to keep you updated okay i'm going to keep you updated once the portal opens there is going to be another video or in any of my videos i'm going to let you know that the portal has finally opened and that you can put in your application so right now what you have to do is to put in your application for any of the two master's course that we have discussed after that you wait to receive an offer once you receive your offer and then you can always put in your scholarship application when the portal opens that is it for today. I wish you all the best with your application and I'll definitely catch you on the flip side. Stay blessed and I am out.